What's good everybody, this is Koza and welcome back to another 2K Labs video. Now in today's video, we're going over the recommended dribble moves for an 80 ball handle. Now these moves surprise me by how good they really are and how good someone with just an 80 ball handle can dribble. So go ahead, drop a like on today's video, subscribe to the channel for more 2K content like this and let's go ahead and get into it. Now starting off with the pro dribble style, a lot of people are using pro dribble style, especially since the Magic Johnson dribble style got nerfed. For size up, we recommend using Dwayne Wade. Now there's nothing too flashy about the size up, it's just short and quick movements to get the job done. So we recommend you try the size up if you guys haven't already. Up next, we are using Rafer Alston regular breakdown combo, but this requires you to be a starter three. If you're not a starter three, then try using Deeran Fox that has a similar animation, but we use this regular breakdown combo for his walk back animation. This will just create a couple feet of separation just enough for you guys to get that shot off. Next, we are using the Paul George aggressive breakdown combo. Now I try to use this on all of my builds. This combo has so much versatility to it. You guys are moving forward. You guys can crab defenders or you can even do a hop jumpers off of this, snatchbacks, hopbacks, you name it, you can do it. Up next, we have the Jimmy Butler escape moves and his turbo in between the legs and his turbo crossovers can have you feeling pretty shifty. As you see, we fake going to the left and then we cross over to the right, leaving our defender going left as we're going to the right. For combo moves, we are using James Harden. Now, his standstill combo moves does an in between the leg and a crossover. Now I like to pull this out whenever a defender is being too aggressive. You see the defender is playing me really high here so I break out the James Harden combo moves and then finish it with a Jimmy Butler turbo crossover and I get a free shot. Next up we have the John Wall crossover and you need to see just in the animations how fast this crossover really is. This is perfect to use in transition to split defenders or just to get a boost of speed whenever you're heading towards the rim. And up next this is what I like to call the budget Jamal Murray behind the back. Now James Harden has a very similar standing behind the back animation to Jamal Murray and both of these animations are really popular just for the separation that they can create. So for anybody that likes the Jamal Murray behind the back but doesn't hit that 83 ball handle threshold try out the James Harden behind the back. Now spin move we have an underrated move the Penny Hardaway spin. This move can catch your defender off guard not only because it's a rare move that you don't see a lot but also it's a fast move to get by your defender. Up next we are using the pro hesitation. Now this is a nice move to speed boost out of and really freeze your defender and really beat them to the rim. And if you guys don't know, you can use your hesitation to speed boost off of a triple threat by just holding right trigger, flicking the right stick, and then running out of it. And last but not least, the John Wall step back. Now this move has both a really good snatchback animation to create space and a really good hop back, both one of the best animations in the game. So an 80 ball handle rating can be really useful in terms of unlocking dribbling animations. So I advise you guys to just add a few animations that we went over in today's video into your offensive bag to help you guys out just that much more so if you guys enjoyed today's video and today's content go ahead leave a like subscribe to the channel and comment down below some animations that you guys like on your 80 ball handle builds with all that being said man it's been koza and i'm out